once again, I am Merlin Sensei, and this is my real life dojo. Thank you everyone for joining me here once again. It is time to open up our loot crate from uh, April, May, June, May. May loot crate. It's been a while since I've been able to do this. I've been so behind with other stuff that's been going on, and I was super late releasing um, April's loot crate, which was fantasy. But this month, the theme is unity, and a lot of stuff has been. Uh, talked about what's been in it and surprisingly enough I haven't seen any spoilers so I have no clue what's going to go ahead and be in here but we can go ahead and take a look boom this thing is huge like I mean it's big but it's not the mega crate which kind of would have been cool but we'll get to that later <clears throat> excuse me my allergies have been going crazy lately so uh, I've had a little bit of a scratchy throat and a little bit of a cough, so hopefully it'll be under control for this video. But we're going to use our handy dandy knife as always, cut the tape, and then let's get started. Now as always, I'm going to go ahead and be a nice host and give you guys the first peek inside. Now I'm not 100% sure if there's supposed to be a t-shirt in here. Definitely feels like there should be, sounds like there should be, unless there's something... I don't know, big and crazy in here, but you guys ready? First peek rooney for you guys. Here we go. Alright, you guys good? Did you get your fill? Alright, let's take a look. Hmm. Ah. Turn it around. Yep, definitely a t-shirt. Um, let's take a look here. Ooh, I know a friend of mine who's going to be super jealous with this one you guys go ahead and take a look it's a little bit hard to tell because of the green screen and everything but um, this is a pretty freaking sweet shirt um, as you might or may not be able to tell this is uh, kind of like the crossover uh, picture between the uh, white tiger ranger and the green dinosaur ranger so it's kind of about you know uh, basically Tommy from the Power Rangers so that's actually very cool um, you know, kind of got that like Japanese motif to it with some of the lettering and everything like that. And I really like it. I'm definitely going to wear it and I'm going to make a couple of people jealous with it. So that is pretty awesome. Let's see what else we've got in here. Of course, we have our Loot Crate official button, Unity. If you can see that right there, maybe a little bit hard to tell. Uh, zoom in a little bit. Yes, no, maybe. Ah. But it's got um, Batman and, I don't know, I'm assuming Superman shaking hands? Maybe it's Cyclops, you know what I mean? Not entirely sure, because this thing is about, you know, uniting the universes and stuff, as you can kind of see from the um, picture in the back, although that's more, you know, fighting between the universes. Still, it's fun. Oh, that's going to be fun. We'll, we'll look at that in a second. Eh, no, we'll look at it now. I got it in my hand. We have a Rick and Morty, uh, if you can see that, 300-piece puzzle. Uh, very cool. Can I get this to zoom in a little bit? Yes, no, maybe? No? I was going to say, one of these days I'd like to get a new camera just to see what we can do with it. But no, it looks pretty cool. Um, if any of you have seen the uh, Rick and Morty cartoon show, then you'll know what kind of goofiness this puzzle is going to go ahead and entail. But um, that's pretty cool. Um, again, probably going to make a friend of mine a little bit jealous. I think Season 2 is starting semi-soon if it hasn't already. But yeah, awesome. We've got ourselves a uh, Marvel Ice Cube tray, as you can see there. Let's go ahead and pop this puppy open really quickly. Uh, just to see the different molds that we have. Alright, we've got the thing, of course, there. And uh, some... Thing fists. Uh, actually, those might be Hulk fists, to be completely honest, so that would be cool. We've also got um, Captain America shield, and of course, we have some Iron Man uh, helmets uh, for our ice cream tray. This is pretty stiff silicone, mm, excuse me, uh, so very durable, uh, very useful. Doesn't always have to be for ice, um, could be used for uh, like Jello Jigglers. Um, you know, different candies and stuff like that if you're into that stuff. But um, the hotter that you um, have the material that goes into the silicon, 
uh, the quicker it's going to go ahead and wear out, just as a heads up for you guys. But still, pretty cool. Might enjoy a uh, tasty beverage during this summer with some uh, cool Marvel uh, ice cubes. That's pretty sweet. Uh, speaking of Marvel, uh, a lot of Marvel stuff in here, it would seem. Nice set of uh, Marvel shoelaces there. Uh, has uh, pretty much just a whole lot of characters on there. Looks like mostly the Avengers, including Spider-Man. Um, but yeah, very cool on that one. We have some Team Fortress 2 uh, buttons. You guys can go ahead and see those right there. Uh, I personally have never played Team Fortress 2 uh, or uh, Hat Simulator uh, 2000, whatever year it came out. <laughs> Uh, that's just a joke. Just a joke. But, um, yeah, they still look pretty cool. Um, what else we got in here? Uh, da -da -da -da. looks like we've got ourselves a decal for the Avengers right there. If you guys can go ahead and see that. Uh, Age of Ultron, uh, from the movie. Um,. Looks like we can go ahead and put that on the car, which would be pretty sweet. Or anything else that we want to go ahead and put a decal on, to be completely honest. Mm, We've got our uh, guide for what's going to be uh, in this uh, month and everything like that, but we'll take a look at that in just a minute. Um, holy shimmy holies. Uh-oh, looks like somebody goofed when they went ahead and packed up... Uh, my box, but uh, more for me in a matter of speaking. Looks like I was lucky enough to go ahead and receive two copies of um, the magazines that were included in this box, uh, which is pretty sweet. So we've got a special Loot Crate edition of Mad Magazine right there, making fun of uh, Game of Thrones, I would go ahead and assume, just from the looks of things. No, not Game of Thrones. Um, I think the show's just called Vikings or something like that. But uh, Unite the Stupid. And we've also got uh, Special Edition uh, Bravest Warriors Tales from the Hollow John. Uh, Loot Crate exclusive right there. So those are going to be cool. Um, usually I keep them wrapped up and stuff like that and I don't get a chance to read them. But since they sent me two of them, I might actually be able to enjoy my magazines for once. But, um, yeah, that is actually going to be it for everything inside the box. Uh, as you can see, we've got the uh, Loot Crate locker room right there with a cat bug up at the top there, the White Ranger helmet, and a couple of other this is and that. So, uh, not too bad. That's pretty cool. But uh, we'll go ahead and put away some of these items really quickly. Uh, keep them nice and fresh. Uh, and then we will go ahead and look at our magazine once I get everything nice and secure. There we go. We can go ahead and come back to that later. Extreme close-up. And now, of course, we take a look at our magazine. Number 22, Unite, for the month of May 2015. Let's see, now I've talked about a couple of other stuff going on there. Some of the past loot crates right there. If you guys remember Covert, always fun. Uh, what else do we got? Talking about the greatest comic teams of all time. Uh, number five is the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Number four are the Fantastic Four. Number three are the Avengers. Number two are the X-Men. And number one, sorry Marvel fanboys, is the Justice League deal with it <laughs> you gotta admit though Justice League was pretty sweet I mean the cartoon series was amazing and I really like Justice League uh, Unlimited as well um, so yeah definitely cool talking about uh, Boom Studios which does a lot of comics nowadays which is pretty cool uh, talking about a new comic coming out from uh, Boom called Lumberjanes uh, and of course the Mega Crate from this month uh, a couple of different items in there. Would have been kind of cool to get, but not a huge deal breaker that we didn't. The PS4 would have been pretty cool. Could have uh, hopefully recorded a couple of uh, video games and stuff like that for the channel, but no biggie. 
Uh, ain't no thing but a chicken wing. But the things that you could have gotten would have been a Team Fortress 2 Buff Banner Backpack, Team Fortress 2 Archimedes Plush, Team Fortress 2 Red Team Scarf and Blue Team Scarf, Team Fortress 2 Bandolier Scarf, Team Fortress 2 Blindbacks Portable Mercs 3-inch Vinyl Figures. Uh, you got a full set of 12 on there. <laughs> Uh, what else? Uh, Team Fortress 2 Vinyl Keycaps, uh, DC Comics A Visual History, HBO's Game of Thrones 7-inch Iron Throne Replica, uh, signed Rick and Morty script, a signed Rick and Morty skateboard, the Kochibukaya Artifacts Avengers Age of Ultron Hulkbuster Iron Man statue, and the PlayStation 4 Limited Edition Batman Arkham Knight 500 Gigabyte Bundle. So that would have been cool. But yeah, just to make sure that we got everything in here, we have our checklist. The exclusive Green Ranger t-shirt, very cool. Uh, the Avengers Age of Ar Ultron car decal, nice. Exclusive Team Fortress 2 buttons, check. Exclusive Bravest Warriors Tales from the Hollow John number one, check. Uh, do, 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 do the Marvel Super Heroes ice tray, also check. Exclusive Mad Magazine Loot Crate Edition. Exclusive Marvel sneaker laces. And the exclusive Rick and Morty 300-piece jigsaw puzzle. So yeah, that's going to go ahead and do everything for us this month. Awesome possum, you guys. Thank you guys so much for joining me. Um, what the heck is this upcoming month's theme? I can't remember off the top of my head, but I want to say it's Cyborg. Or something similar to that. For some reason, I just have that in my head cyborgs robots i don't know it's gonna be something like that but uh thanks for hanging out with me guys don't forget i do live stream every single night uh usually i get started around 10 p.m eastern standard time uh, 11 p.m at the latest if some real life issues get in the way um i'm gonna go ahead and put the link on the screen right now boom there you are should say twitch.tv slash Merlin underscore sensei. Thank you, me. Come join me, guys. Hang out with me. Have a good time. Say hi. Follow me on Twitch. Do all the good stuff. You know what I mean? But yeah, thank you once again for joining me here in my real-life dojo. I have been Merlin Sensei. You have all been absolutely amazing. And of course, until next time, guys, bye for now. Mm -hmm.